What's going on, collectives? It is your girl, Janiqua A, and I am back with another reading for you guys. If no one told you guys today, I love you, and I know all your dreams and aspirations matter because they do. So let's tap in, collectives. Let's see what's going on. Let's see how you feeling. What's up with your energy and what the divine wants you to know at this time? Our Archangel Michael and Allegra, please protect me as I channel this message. Please protect my mind, my body, and my spirit. And let's see what you got going on. All right, birth. So this is about your womb. This is about your womb. Bringing life. Bringing creativity. Bringing opportunities to the world. All right? So this is your womb. This is where, this is where things get created. All right? So this is about your womb. Spirit, what else about this energy? Wow, bless. This is a blessing. Your mind, your body, and your spirit is aligned for this blessing. Your heart is open for this blessing. It's like your womb. Thank you, spirit. You in your divine feminine energy. Your womb is fertile. All right? you Your, your womb is fertile. You don't have no blockages that's interfering with you bringing life to this world, with you creating in this world, with you bringing opportunities to this world. There's no blockages. Okay, so I feel like there's a blessing coming from your womb through this egg, whether it's a project, whether it's a child, whether it's a manifestation, whether it's an idea. It's what you're bringing to this world from you, your womb. It's your creativity. It's your creative idea. It's your manifestation. It's yours. A lot, a lot went into, you know, your womb being fertile with this egg. All right. So if you was owning a business, you had to sacrifice a lot. You had to go through the ups and downs. You had to go through the mind, body, and spirit going through a reprogram. If this is a child, you went through a lot of ups and downs when it comes to having your womb blocked. All right? When it comes to having people, places, and things that wasn't providing you any justice when pushing this through. So this is a blessing that you are pushing through your womb. Congratulations. Congratulations. This is like the hands of God giving you this. Like here, the world needs this. Spirit, tell me more about this energy for the collectors. Wow. This is a seed that you planted on the earth. All right, this is the seed that you've planted. All right, this is harvest time. It has grown. All right, wow. This is something earthly. This is in a physical. This is a physical blessing that is coming through your womb. It has love. You, you, this seed was created out of love. That's why I'm getting Empress energy. The only time something could come through your womb like this is if your heart chakra was open on earth. This is a lot of love. Whatever this blessing is, it is a lot of love. All right? It's a, it was a lot of dedication to put into this. All right? This is, this is your seed. You planted a seed. All right? And now it's ready to come through your womb. Wow, this is amazing, collective. This is amazing, a uh, fuck amazing. All right, so let's see. Let's let's keep four, four, four on the clock. You are protected. You are on the right track. All right, your wound is protected. Your wound is protected. Four, four, four. You could be seeing four, four, four a lot. 
I'm seeing the letters B and E. Wow. Spirit, tell me more about this um, birth. Please and thank you. Oh my gosh, the three of cups. Success. This was a group effort. All right. This is a time of celebration. Wow. The three of cups. That's celebration. That's achievements. That's accomplishments. That's something to celebrate about. That's your womb being fertile. That's something celebrated about. That's a blessing coming through you. All right. Successfully. Expect positive recognition. Expect people to be happy for you that you never thought to be happy for you. Expect this, this creation to bring your soul family together. All right. Wow. A success. Mom, body, and spirit. Three. You could be saying three, 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 four, four, four. Spirit, tell me more about this blessing. You might be drinking a lot of soup right now. God, thank you, spirit. You might be drinking instead of eating. You might be finding yourself drinking a lot of liquid because God is preparing this wound. All right. You might not even be wanting to eat the same things no more. Your wound is being cleared out. The seven of swords. The world card. Don't this look like the womb? All right. You have to be silent about this. You have to be silent about this. You have to tiptoe. All right. I feel like there may have been a lot of attacks on your womb collectives. And you might have had a lot of people. Wishing bad, all right, on this blessing. But it's here, all right? So whoever was wishing bad, whoever was wishing negative, whoever was trying to keep you in a low vibrational state to block your womb, it's over for that. This shit is coming through this portal. This shit is coming through your womb. World card, all right? You have completed all the steps. You need you you did all you needed to do. The world card. The world card is the last card out of the tarot deck. You went through your journey to get this blessing. So there's no stopping you. Maybe you had to learn to keep shit private. Not that you was trying to hide, but it was you had a lot of people working on your womb. You had a lot of groups working on your womb. Alright? This can even be a group of people working on your womb. Alright? Trying to make you stay in a low vibrational state. But they can't, baby. The world card. This is yours. All right? This meant the world to you. Okay? That's why you got to move in silence. Everything is personal right now. We, we, it's no time to keep letting shit slide. This shit is personal to you. All the time. All the sacrifices. Everything that you did to get to this. Yeah, this is personal for you. This is a personal achievement coming through you. All right? So, Yeah. You close out a cycle on telling a lot of people your business, all right? Telling people a lot of your manifestations. That will give people access to your creations, to your womb, all right? So, yeah, something made it through. You just got to be very silent. Everybody don't need to know your blessings, Everybody is not going to be happy for you. There's a selective, selective fruit. Few might be three motherfuckers that you tell about this huge blessing coming through your womb. All right. From the seed that you planted of love. This is a, this is a seed of love. All right. So spirit, tell me more about this seed, please. And thank you. Tell me more about this seed. Damn. All right. The emperor and a motherfucking star. All right, this could be two people or one. All right, 
But the emperor is a father. The emperor is a father figure. The emperor is a provider. The emperor is um, a decision maker. They have a lot of authority over people. All right. They also went through the struggles. They also been through the through the trials and tribulations of the terror deck to become emperor. So this could be a father, a father figure. All right. The star. This is a wish come true. This is a wish come true for whoever this emperor is. Spirit, give me more on this emperor, please. The Ten of Pentacles. All right. Wow, the King of Pentacles. There's a masculine that has achieved a level of success when it comes to an empire, when it comes to a family, when it comes to a legacy being born. Okay? Literally. This man is a great provider. All right. This man is a great businessman. This man has went through a lot of things to unlock this legacy and generational wealth. This could have been 10 years coming. All right. This is going to be a great man of the house. Ten of Pentacles to the Emperor. Bitch, all your bills going to be paid. You hear me? And he's going to take pride in doing that. Wow. Wow, spirit. Tell me who this star is. This is a masculine energy that's really going to show you what a, a king and an emperor is supposed to be like in your life. All right? Spirit, tell me this star, please. Oh, my gosh. Two. I'm getting two. It's double the, double the trouble. Double the pleasure. Two is better than one. All right. Maybe they was juggling, juggling their dreams, juggling something else. Spirit, tell me more about this two of pentacles, please. Balance, duality, the king of wands. They was getting themselves together to be this emperor. All right. They was getting their money right. And they was, they was taking the right actions. They had to, they had to probably wait a little while. They had to probably juggle a couple of things to find balance. All right. But this man is a great man. He's coming out as king of wands. He's a doer. Okay. He was, it, it's looking like he was preparing for this. Preparing his mind, body, and spirit for this. Spirit soul, who? Who is this three of cups then? Wait, let's see. Who is this three of cups then? Who is the world? Who was he collaborating with? Damn, the four of wands. All right, whoever he was collaborating with, they were building a solid foundation for a wands. This is definitely also twin flame energy. You could be seeing 11 11. This is a whole lot of success and celebrations. All right, for some of you guys, you can be relocating. All right, in the community that you're relocating, bitch, you got, you got a whole castle, you got land, and you're welcomed. Like, it's welcomed. All right, you're welcome. You're welcoming this birth. Ah! The Empress, bitch. The Empress, bitch. You got your Emperor to the Empress. This is a very successful, happy, and stable family. Your mind, your body, and your spirit, all right, was open to receive this blessing. Divine Feminine Empress, your wound is fertile, and there is a blessing. The seed of love is coming through your womb. All right? You are love. You are the Venus sign. All right? You are royalty. All right? This is y'all. This is y'all. This is y'all solid, solidifying your life. Ain't no more thinking about struggles no more. Ain't no more thinking about how the fuck we gonna pay bills. Ain't no more thinking about how the kids gonna eat, baby. Ain't no more thinking about your careers and what path you going. Y'all already solidified. Y'all both got to empress and emperor energy. There's no queens out here. There's no... What it was is this man was a work in progress. He was working on how to be, the, be that boss. He was working on how to be that father and how to be that person to himself. He can't possibly be, be an emperor to an empress if he's not together. 
And that's what I think that he did. He, he made sure that he was working on himself. Okay? So, y'all house, y'all money, y'all reputation. Okay, y'all kingdom, the love, y'all children is solidified. All right? Y'all not going to have to want for nothing. Nothing. All right? This is what happens when you co-create with the person you're supposed to be with. Okay, Empress Energy. Okay, Empress Energy. Divine Feminine Energy, the moon card. All right, this is also secrecy. Okay, something coming fast though. All right, so I love you guys. I really hope this helped. Congratulations, Divine Feminine and Divine Masculine. Y'all have reached a level within yourselves as Emperor and Empress individually. Now y'all coming into co-creating from this womb. All right. There's a blessing here that y'all planted. All right. Together. All right. This man is going to be that man that's going to be able to provide. You know, the empress is very fruitful. All right. You're not going to have to do it alone. This man is going to take pride into giving. All right. Because you may have been a giver before, but it's going to be balanced. All right. This man is fucking head over heels attracted to you. All right. They're willing to take action now. Okay, and the emperor, that's the father, the mother here. Okay, y'all closed out that cycle. Ain't no going back. All right, so I love you guys, and I really hope this helps.